Hi Pitmasters, today we're grilling a fantastic chicken piri piri on a Napoleon Pro Travel Q285. Wanna have a sneak peek? There she is. So to make this piri piri, we're going to start off with grilling four chili peppers. We're going to grill them until they turn nice and soft on the inside and charred on the outside. When they're done, we're going to let them cool for a minute, chop off the top, open them up and take out the seeds. This will help to get out the sharpness for the piri piri. Now I'm making this for the kids as well. So if you like a more sharp piri piri, just leave in the seeds. Next up we're going to chop three garlic cloves. Add all this into a jar. Add one cup olive oil, a quarter cup cider vinegar, and a quarter cup of your favorite whiskey or bourbon. Then give it a good shake and let the marinade sit for an hour in the fridge. We're going to take out the backbone of the chicken and then flatten the chicken out. Carve the chicken, this will increase the surface of the chicken. Brush on that piri piri sauce and set it aside for 6 hours in the fridge. So you can do this for instance in the morning before you start barbecuing. Then we'll place the chicken over direct heat on the grill. It should be a low heat. When we have enough char, we're moving the chicken over to an indirect heat. When the chicken has reached a temperature of 65 degrees Celsius or 160 degrees Fahrenheit, it's done. We're taking it off the grill and let it rest for 5 to 10 minutes. Well, I've got a nice piece of chicken wing here from the Piri Piri chicken. I'm going to give it a try. It's so crispy because of the oil. It's so tender and juicy. It looks really good. It looks... I mean, it tastes really good. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Give this recipe a try because you're absolutely going to love it. Don't forget to put salt on your chicken. And um, you will have an awesome dinner. Thanks for watching. See you guys next week.